When you want to replace or upgrade your CenturyLink modem, or if you cancel your internet service and have been leasing your modem, you'll need to return that equipment to us. We'll walk you through how to get your return label and pack up your modem so that it reaches us safely and is processed correctly. Let's start by getting your return label. Go to CenturyLink.com slash return modem. From this page, select Start Your Return. On the next screen, select Continue as Guest. Now fill in the form with your name, mailing address, and email address. Be sure to use the same name and address that are on your CenturyLink account. This will make sure your account is credited correctly. Next, choose how you want to receive your return label. You can print it out yourself from email or get a quick scan code to use in a UPS store. Once you've made your choice, click Submit. If you choose the Print and Email option, check your inbox for an email from UPS return labels. If you choose the QR code option, you'll receive an email from UPS return labels that contains your scannable code and a link to find the UPS store closest to you. Now it's time to pack up your equipment. Gather your modem or gateway and all wireless accessories and power cables that were supplied by CenturyLink. Now get a strong box with enough room to hold all the items with some space around them for packing material. Pack the modem, all cords, and other accessories into the box. Use plenty of cushioning materials such as bubble wrap, paper padding, or packing peanuts to make sure the equipment is held securely in place and well padded. Once you have your box ready, it's time to get your label. If you printed your own, fold the paper on the solid line and attach it to one side of the box using a clear shipping pouch or by covering the entire label with clear tape. Next, drop the box off at any authorized UPS shipping center near you. If you are using a QR code, take your packed and sealed box to your chosen UPS store, show the code from your email, and the UPS employee will scan it, print your label, and send your package. If you're canceling service or switching out your modem with a new one, make sure you send it to us within 30 days to avoid being charged the full cost of the leased equipment. To view full setup instructions and get started with your return, visit CenturyLink.com slash return modem.